gotta go. Can't imagine the suits are gonna be too happy. Let's let this suit speak for himself, shall we? Damn. Of all the impulsive, unhinged disasters I've witnessed in my career, my dear, that had to be one of the most excellent. Wait, what? You went out and defeated Shotzi. And then, when things went sideways, you kept your head, stood up for yourself, and made a memorable moment for everyone in the WWE Universe. Well done. So you'll still pay me then? You're not only getting paid. I'd like to offer you a full-time WWE Raw contract. With all due respect, I'm not sure if I'm the type of person you want working for you. You have a lot of assumptions about who we are and what we want. And, with all due respect, I'd suggest letting us decide those things for ourselves. I heard how people responded, and I'm telling you, WWE wants you. I truly appreciate the offer, sir, but I... Can we have a moment? I don't really think we need to... Just give us a second. Why not? I'm just in the middle of a live show and trying to offer you a life-changing opportunity. But please, take your time. that wasn't you about to tell William Regal no to a WWE contract. Wait, is this you telling me to say yes to William Regal in a WWE contract? Why wouldn't you sign? Everything we've built together with TBD, our mission, you know how much it means to me. I don't want to abandon TBD, and I don't want to abandon you. TBD isn't going anywhere. You think I'm going to let our momentum stop just because you get to go to the bigs? No way! Give it a chance. You hate it here, you come back home. But don't say no to the adventure. I mean, it is kind of cool that Regal recognizes what I bring to the table. And that was only one match. You did that with what everyone assumed would be a quick victory for Shotzi. And you don't think this is selling out? Remember when we decided to start TBD? Of course I do. As much as I wish I could forget that show, that promoter had such a narrow vision of what wrestling should be. And we sat down at that diner and decided if we ever started a promotion, we would let all kinds of people with all types of ideas get in the ring and fight, literally, for their vision. Yeah, we were very idealistic before we had to pay bills. <laughs> Remember those contracts we signed with each other on those diner napkins? <laughs> but we did follow through on all of those plans. Aside from coming up with a name besides TBD, of course. My point is, we had a mission. Still do. And now, you're getting a very real chance to take your vision to a company that has more reach than anyone else. You really want to make a difference and change this industry into what you think it could be? You can't say no. Guess I have to find Regal and tell them yes then. I'll let you get to it. Just don't big time us when you come home to visit, okay? <laughs> no promises. There she is, the so-called captain, who came out of nowhere to defeat Shotzi and earn a raw contract. Came out of nowhere for you, maybe, but anyone who's been paying attention to the independent wrestling scene knows this woman has been a champion and a cornerstone of the promotion known as TBD for quite some time. WWE and Raw are lucky to have her. Hello, hello, welcome to Raw, big fan, big fan. Really? Oh, everyone on the team is a longtime admirer. Ever since we got word last week. 
It's a quick pivot to squeeze you in, but we're used to things changing fast around here. Not a problem at all. Didn't think it would be? I'm Troy Simkin. Yep, I'm that guy. I'm sure you've heard the more established superstars mention their favorite WWE producer. I don't think I have. Hmm. Are you not mingling with your peers? That's kind of a must-do around here. Actually, we have several handy documents outlining all the unwritten do's and don'ts. Doesn't that make them written? But before we get sidetracked, what I was getting at is we already have a few ideas of how to use you. But we'll be in touch. Do you maybe want to talk about some of the things I've been thinking or am interested in doing? Like I said, get settled. We're working on some ideas. Gotta run. Later, Cat. They actually call me Cap. Huh. Could have sworn it was Cat. Oh well. We'll see where we land with the name. What are you doing here? Working raw too now? Nah, just in the neighborhood. But since I am here, anything I can help you with? Happy to walk you through how things work around here. I'd appreciate that. There's no shame in admitting that while I know what I'm doing in the ring, the backstage politics of this place are a bit intimidating. <laughs> That's a feature, not a flaw. But honestly, it's probably the same as you're used to at any indie event. Use the time before any show to change your gear and level up your skills. And most importantly, don't forget to check your social media and talk to people backstage. That's pretty much how all opportunities around here come about. Makes sense. Is that it? Pretty much. Check your social media and talk to people and you'll find yourself in matches and rivalries in no time. Just remember that once you agree to do something, you'll have to see it through before you can turn your focus to something else. Copy that. Thanks, Justine. No problem. Good luck, superstar. A leader in or out of the ring. The captain. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making our way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England. Ever since she arrived in WWE, we've been wondering who Cap really is. Now, I think everyone can see. A natural leader who is earning her colleagues respect? That seems like a good reputation to have. Cap is on a mission tonight. The generation of Jade has begun. And I don't think it'll ever end. And from Chicago, Illinois, Cora Jane! As far as Cora's concerned, no one measures up to her. She's on another level. And you know what? 
I think she might be right. She has a thorny and jealous attitude. That's for certain. And she's always ready to pick a big fight. Get ready to see the toughness of Cora Jade on full display. Well, she showed up with a kendo stick, so we get it. She's tough. Cora Jade finds herself squaring off against a newly focused and mindful opponent in Cap. Yeah, I heard she's recently embraced meditation and is looking to reach an entirely new plane of wrestling out there. Well, her cheese may be aligned now, but after Cora Jade's through with her, I doubt they'll stay that way. Look at this. Snap suplex. And Jade gave an opening, and it was capitalized on. And another counter. Oh. oh my goodness. Oh man, that's like death by a thousand cuts. Kick to the gut. Cracked around into a neck breaker. Big forearm. Oh, look at the start of this. Could be going into the playbook for submission. Oh, nowhere to go. Nowhere to. Almost a miraculous escape in a side slam. Went into the corner now. Oh, another oh, one for good measure. Just like that, we've kicked the tempo up a notch. She's rising back up on those wobbly legs. Blockbuster! She's losing some steam now. Yeah, Cole, but at this point in the match, you still haven't lost the edge. Kick to the body. Double underhook into a DDT. Off into the pin. Two count sends off the three count. This could be a tipping point in this match. Maybe not. Maybe not. She powers out immediately there. She's still got a lot of stamina left. Wicked roundhouse kick. Cora just can't stop this attack. Jade needs to find a trick in her playbook now. Answering back. Jade showing how much punishment she can withstand before getting her own offense in. The U-turn core needed in this match could have been that right there. Why is she still boasting around? She's in a fight for goodness sake. And this one might be headed ringside. Hip toss takedown. Whoa, that was nice. She's starting to look concerned. Yeah, Cora showed that killer instinct. Oh my gosh. Oh, what impact. And then the nice leg sweep. Got the front face lock applied. Nice suplex. And that was a well-targeted attack. Nicely done, snap suplex. So quick. Oh, that was just malicious. Just disrespectful. She flips it back on her. Inverted face lock into an elbow drop. Look at this, just stop after stop after stop. And Jade's caught with a reverse. 
reversal. Oh, boy, that's a determined stare that's come across her face. Jade is in big, big trouble. Makes the cover. She did it. She picked up the victory. Here is your winner. Cora Jade suffering the loss in this one. It looks like the generation of Jade just had a setback. So, sounds like Nikki's got you hooked on the Breath app, too? It did seem to help me in my last match. I like it. I'm not sure I'd say I'm hooked. Oh, you'll get hooked. The whole thing's a pyramid scheme. The meditation app? The one that trains you to breathe? That's how it starts. Before long, I was breathing all the time. Now that I'm nearly the diamond level, I don't think I could stop breathing if I tried. That just sounds like basic biology. But if it's bothering you that much, and you're really worried it's some sort of pyramid scheme, why don't you just quit? Oh no, let me be clear. I don't care that it's a pyramid scheme, as long as I'm at the top. Plus, at Diamond level, there are a ton of new perks. All I've got to do is sign up a couple more people. I know we're technically sisters of the breath, but if you try to cop any of my referrals, I will drop you. All good. I'm just in it for the breathing. You sound so gold level right now. Commanding the ring and forging her path, the captain. The following contest is a six woman battle royal. Making her way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England. From indie legend to WWE superstar, Cap is always ready for action. Yeah, this isn't some smoke filled bingo hall, Saxton. It's WWE. If the so-called captain wants to prove herself here, she's got to do it in the ring. It's time for Indy Cred to be put to the test. has been counting the days, hours, and minutes for this match to start, and the countdown is almost over. She is ready for this big match, and she knows everyone backstage will be watching her make an impact. Zia Lee is not here to make friends. She is here to compete. One of a kind in this division is a vicious, dangerous martial artist and master of wushu. She is more than ready to be the master of the squared circle. And from 
from Chongqing, China, Zia Li. Zia Li has placed an enormous sense of pressure on herself to succeed. Well, that's because she expects the best of herself and refuses to accept failure. Zia Lee is ready for the women's division and the WWE Universe to take notice of her hard work and skill. Zelina might be little, but she is fierce. And representing the LWO from Queens, New York, Zelina Vega! Zelina, one of the smallest competitors with the biggest heart. Yeah, now Zelina is sitting under the learning tree of Rey Mysterio and the rest of the LWO. Zelina really has a chance to break out even further. Zelina looking to make the LWO and her family proud tonight. The Welsh Dragon herself. And from the Welsh Valleys, Tegan Knox. This woman is the personification of resilience, has suffered multiple torn ACLs in both knees, yet still continues to give it her all in the ring. Yeah, and even shares a little knee brace fashion with none other than Stone Cold Steve Austin. A feel-good story every time Tegan Knox competes. Here comes Caden Carter. Such an exciting talent to watch. And from the Philippines, Caden Carter. Caden Carter, a former collegiate basketball star, has been doing big things since coming to WWE. Yeah, it's that athletic mindset that has made her such a fierce competitor. I am so impressed by Carter's dedication to her craft in the ring. And she has unshakable confidence whenever she competes. Six fearless contenders are facing off apparently with meditation mystery on the line. You know, back in the day, I got in the ring for some silly reasons, but this one might top them all. Looks like someone hasn't reached Emerald Rubble yet. Looking for elimination here. Zyli has been eliminated. Oh, this could be the end here. Big right hand. Counter from Carter. Ooh, oh, Carter has been eliminated. All the way to the floor. Being sent out like yesterday's trash. Just goes to show you the level of animosity here tonight. Just going all out with every blow. Snap suplex. Very nice. the 
ring now. Discus clothesline. A running Hurricane Rana. Showing off the quickness. That'll turn things around in a hurry. Oh, straight forearm. Wow, look at that agility. Delivering the suplex. All the way up. The crash landing powerbomb. Now that's what you call impact. And the scary thing is, these attacks are being done with great ease. Oh, what power to counter down into a DDT. Oh, man. And I can assure you that wasn't part of Zelina's usual cold and calculating strategy. Seeing some no-nonsense offense from Ava. Nicely done. An inverted scoop slam. A oh, straight forearm. And now dropping the bombs. Practically never-ending blows. Coming at full force here. Ooh, just relentless. She will wisely return to the ring now. Up and... Oh, knee right to the spine. Ooh. Drop toe hold. Ooh, well measured. Mm. Gets dumped by the suplex. Oh my God! Giant suplex. A running hurricane rana. Beautiful. Sometimes you just gotta show off and show up. She's pushed into the corner. To the back of the knee. Surprise plant. And it's a long way down from there. Oh, what are they going to do here? Oh, this is going to be nasty. For an avalanche phantom driver. That move wasn't originally intended for the top rope, but that's what we just saw. My, oh, my, what elevation. How to rock anybody. Damn. Zelina Vega has been eliminated. She's getting fired up, ready to show her opponent what she's got. Leg sweep takedown. Ooh, dropped right on their face. She's about to rise up to something catastrophic. Tight spot for Ava here. Oh, man, into the neck breaker. Oh, Moreno's in the worst way now. Hammer. And a six-man match is all over. Here is your winner. They just won a very important match. She worked hard for this win, and now she gets to enjoy the payoff. Absolutely. You love to see someone's determination come to fruition like this. Have you managed to sign anyone up to the app yet? Or are you still just a fledgling gasper? A what? No. I just use the app. I'm not into all the hunting for recruits and everything. Great. Then who do you know who might want to use the program? And will you give me their emails, phone numbers, addresses, and social security numbers, if you have them? Um, no. Come on, Cap. You're messing with my livelihood here. Your livelihood? You're a wrestler, last I checked. For now? But for how long? This could be my career post-WWE. 
A pyramid scheme? Take that back. You don't use those terms. Those terms are forbidden among the breathers. Who told you this was a pyramid scheme? You, a week ago. A week's a long time. I'm gonna get to diamond level, and now I understand the app's vision. Picture it. A world where everyone, everywhere, no matter their background or income, breathing. <laughs> Isn't everyone already breathing? Not properly. They don't know. The outsiders don't know the true power of the breath. Okay, I have to be honest with you. You're making this whole thing sound really crazy. If this is what the app is doing to people, I think I'm just gonna breathe on my own. Then I can no longer speak with you. I must sever all connections with outsiders because they are not one with the breath and therefore hinder my path to enlightenment and disrupt the harmony within our sacred community. You've severed all connection with reality. And I hate to tell you this, but you're in a cult. That word is even more forbidden than pyramid scheme. It is my sacred duty to defend my sisters of the breath. You and me, in the ring, now! Try not to pop every blood vessel before we even get there. Welcome a superstar who defines tenacious, brave, and driven. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making our way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England. Ugh. Cap looks like she is itching to throw hands tonight. Then she's come to the right place. Her opponent wants nothing more than to take that big indie reputation and drag it through the mud. Yeah. The captain is ready to call the shots. a fever pitch upon their arrival and we are just seconds away from a highly anticipated match. Such an incredible journey for this woman, but she knows a win tonight will take her even further. Ava Moreno takes to defending the breathing community against Cap the Dissenter. Saxton, it might be time for an intervention. If you just use the link I sent. Let's keep our focus in the ring, gentlemen. Shoulders down to the count. Premature to try to end things now. What impact! If a shortcut presents itself, you're looking for the quick pin. And she's not done yet. She just shocked everyone in the ring. Left by the turnbuckles. Back with a rebound, and that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. And momentum is slipping away from Moreno. Yeah, Ava has to pull a trick from her sleeve. As the leg trap, Fisherman suplex goes into the pin. Gets the shoulder up. Wow, what's it going to take? Still in it. She starts to rise back up, but does she know where she is? She's calling for it. Got the front face lock applied. Nice suplex. 
You can tell a fire has been lit inside of her. Yeah, she's doing a good job carrying out her game plan. Forearm to the jaw. This match is wearing her down. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. Might want to think about picking up the pace a bit. Why is she still boasting around? She's in a fight for goodness sake. Takes down their opponent. Kicked right on the side of the face. And she doesn't connect. Power slam. And shoulders are down. She breaks the count quick. Impressive to not even allow a two count at this juncture. Incapacitating the shoulder. Handstand into the elbow drop. And Ava could be wasting time. Oh, she'd had enough of that. Manages to escape before the three count. You have to think this match is starting to take its toll. And now dropping the bombs. You can't get caught in a hailstorm like that if you want to win. Out of the ring, she has to mind the 10 count. Big time powerbomb. Oh boy, to the announce table now. Oh yeah, gonna clean it off here. This is gonna be dangerous. We knew this superstar had a mean streak. We didn't realize that they were downright ruthless. So take things into the ring. How to rock anybody. Face first. Look at her stumble back up. Probably seeing double vision. Go! Ava felt the full force of that one. Cover. What a kick out in two. What is it going to take to keep her down? The answer might be more than her opponent can offer. You got to give a lot of credit here, withstanding what has taken out many other competitors. Is it enough? The cover! Two! It's over all in a nice work. Here is your winner. Sharon's the W against fierce competition. Yep, that's what we call a good day at the office. Here she is, the formidable and unflappable Cap. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England. Ew! The look of determination on Cap's face speaks volumes, Corey. This is a woman looking to climb all the way to the top of WWE. It's good to have goals, but we're just going to have to see if she has what it takes to make the climb. I have my doubts. Up aboard, it's go time for the captain. Here comes everyone's favorite bundle of insanity. And from Glasgow, Scotland, Nikki Cross. The superhero's flown the coop. Nikki's now somehow even more unhinged than before.
Guys, did you know that Nikki has a master's degree in history? Wait, wait, what? That is mind-blowing. Since Nikki looks like she can't remember what happened five minutes ago, much less 500 years ago. We've got a breathtaking showdown as Cap tries to ring the last gas from a meditation app, and Nikki Cross fights to breathe new life into its reach. It's embarrassing how a multi-level marketing thing has led someone to wanting to throw down over a lack of sign-ups. Let's just all remember how easy it is to get wrapped up in stuff like this. It can happen to anybody. <laughs> I honestly can't believe we just saw a human being tossed like that. She's on unsteady legs in the corner, needs to recover. Oh, look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Sidewalk slam. And the count. She breaks the count quick. Yeah, she probably knew that cover wouldn't do it. Oh, look at the kicks. And then the roundhouse leg sweep. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Cross can't stop any offense coming her way. Cross is going to have to dig down deep here. And a series of vicious stomps. And if the first stomp doesn't send you the message, the follow-up ones definitely will. Here. Oh, look at this, the school girl! Oh, somehow! Not yet. And an elbow. And she denies Cross. Oh, my God, a DDT! And that move might have been Nikki's kryptonite. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. Nicely done. Is it enough? Two! I can't make sense of that decision. She might have had the pinfall in hand. Into the corner now. Not where you want to be right now. Big right hand, and this is not going to end well. Positioning their opponent. It's away the attack and answers with a bulldog. Ooh, what a forearm club. A well-timed dodge. Cross can't stop any offense coming her way. Yeah, Cross needs to come up with a new plan fast. Nice plant. You can tell she wants to put an end to this. Cross left an opening. Oh, man, into the neck breaker. Oh. Cross is out. That's it. Here is your winner, yeah. Gressel, perhaps the perfect match. Never any doubt in this win. An absolute statement by the victor here tonight. What a steamrolling.